which is why you can see a long queue right over here yep they are actually queuing up to to try on the uh, this gauntlet okay so yep we'll try it on <laughs> and see how it looks like so since this one is not wearable for Hulk I know the next one you guys wanted to see is on this Mark 85 okay so let's try on him first and of course I will need to remove his right hand okay yep so like I said earlier on um, it's not going to fit very well because it's just an empty hole inside so the custom maker actually mentions that we need to use some blue tag okay so I have some here which is uh, quite a bit just put it in just to make sure that um, it fits into the arms <clears throat> so that it won't be you know drop out so easily yes so this is how it will looks like although it's not going to fit very well like I say but at least it does looks okay you know to have a gauntlet which is by far I think uh, pretty nice because a light up okay this is one of the best features for this um, infinity gauntlets that you can see looks very nice oh and one more thing I would like to point out is the six tone which is this one uh, the green stone um, is it yeah this is the time stone it couldn't be lightened up by the likes because of some um, you know design issues the creator actually mentioned he couldn't um, get the lights to light up here as opposed to this piece this one can actually light up everything except for the wearable one this piece will not be able to light up so this is a design issue okay so he, he hopes that uh, <laughs> collectors will be able to you know overlook this because it's a simple design issues that he can't seems to solve okay so yeah but it does looks very nice that we have five stone that is actually you know lighted up yeah this looks very good even though it doesn't fit well but it just looks pretty good there with the snapping pose okay wow and the next one we'll try of course is on captain america i will move his hand first okay i think he's going to look great on him yes okay <laughs> yes this is you're gonna say i am steve rogers <laughs> snap okay yeah so this is how it looks like okay yep so let's give the rest a chance to wear So since I have tested on quite a number of SH figures, I will move on to test on some Mayfax. I have the Infinity War Thor here. Okay, let's try on him and see how does it looks. Uh, yeah, I think it looks okay. <laughs> yeah, kind of like fitting over here as you can see. It's, it's because um, it's not as skinny as the SH figure, so uh, the, this tall arm just looks like a bit more fitting. It looks great there. Okay, let's light it up. Wow, okay. <laughs> this looks very, very badass. And still on Mayfax, I will try on the Iron Spider right over here. And I think it's going to feel very weird because he have a small arm there. So it just looks very weird. <laughs> okay, and let's light it up. Okay, so this is how Peter Parker Spider-Man how it looks like. <laughs> Okay, this looks kind of okay though because of the red, this matches it very well. Okay, next we'll move on to some Mesco. I have the tall Ragnarok here and let's try it on. Okay, yeah, I think again it does looks pretty fitting because uh, for Mesco figure, I think this looks uh, a bit more thicker compared to the SH figure. So this kind of looks like, you know, if it does fits quite well. Okay, and light it up. Yep. I think it looks great. Wow, okay. Nice one. 
Moving on to some Marvel Legends, I have the Iron Man Mark 85 right over here and uh, let's hope it fits well because the Marvel Legends arm is also slightly bigger than the SH3 quads. Uh, not very well but it does looks okay though. Um, the red doesn't really seem to match. Yep. Okay, let's slide it up. I am Iron Man. Okay. <laughs> Wow, okay, so if the, you guys are looking for a light up Infinity Gauntlet, I think this is a very good one. And lastly, for Marvel Legends, just for the fun of it, I would like to try on this Venom, okay? Yeah, I just want to see how it looks like. And wow, okay, so it does have a bigger arms, and uh, I think it does fits pretty nicely this time. <laughs> okay, yep, just slide it up. Yep. Wow. We are inevitable. <laughs> and lastly, I would like to try on NECA. I have the movie version of the Ninja Turtles. Okay, <laughs> yeah, just somehow crossed my mind that I would like to try on. It's just for the fun of it. Uh, no, I don't think it works because of the uh, arms, uh, bandana or something. It just kind of restricts it from going in, unfortunately. Um, but I think this looks. Uh, okay <laughs> a little bit okay yep Kaubanga dude I have the infinity gauntlet here <laughs> what do you think <laughs> just for the fun of it I think it's okay <laughs> yeah hey guys Deadpool here do you guys miss me I want to try on the gauntlet as well hey I got it on it looks good on me hmm why isn't it being light up? Let me give it a few smack. Light up, light up, light up, light up, light up, light up. Aha, there you go. Yep, it looks kind of cool, ain't it? I can even dig my nose with it. Okay, I'm going to touch myself with this gauntlet. Bye guys. And guess what guys? I almost forgot a very important aspect of this set, which is a table okay yeah because as you can see it's kind of weird to have this uh, marvelous set on the floor so they actually provide a table that comes with it yeah I almost forgot about this sorry about that so yeah this is just a very simple table but it looks very very nice because of the translucent I kind of like it and it actually requires some assembly here which is pretty simple because all you need to do is just to screw it up yeah, you literally have to screw it up. And as you can see, there is a piece of paper that is wrapping up the table to actually minimize the scratches. So you can actually tear it off to actually show the very, very nice table. Yep. Okay, wow. As you can see, it's actually reflective. Okay. It's very nice. Can you see that? My goodness. Wow. Okay, you can see my light here. <laughs> Wow, this is nice. Okay, and then um, there's also four legs that comes with it. Okay, of course the four legs are also translucent, just like the table. Yep, very very nice. So all you need to do, like I say, is to screw it up. Okay, yep. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm done here. As you can see, wow, it just looks very, very good. Yep, my goodness. And I think it matches this very well. Wow, just look at that. Goodness, goodness. Wow. So now I think it will scale very, very well with the rest of the figure. Okay, so let's have some figure around it to have a look. First off, I have the Captain America right over here. Wow. Okay, now scale pretty well. Then I have, of course, the Tony Stark Mark 85. Okay, and of course, how can we miss the Hulk? Okay, I'll put it behind so you can see how well, oops, so you can see how well it is, okay? And as you can see, I think now it does looks very, very good. I mean, with the table that brought it up to scale with the rest of the figure. Wow, I'm just speechless on how good it looks.
Okay, so my final verdict for this custom-made hot gauntlet workshop set is I'm going to give it a solid 9.5 out of 10. Yes, it is beautifully crafted, it has light-up functions, and it uses a new technology, at least for me, by using a magnet to actually activate the lights on and lights off. The gauntlets even have blinking functions, and it can also be worn on different different figures that you have like i tested earlier on so what else can you ask for this will actually be very nice to be sitting on your collection is especially if you have a diorama for the uh, avengers it will be the center of attention in your collections display so i'm truly recommending it to those of you who are really interested to get it from the xd custom and in the next screen i'm going to show their contact details such as their facebook page their instagram page as well as their twitter page so feel free to actually contact them to ask for quotes of their price and also the availability of these products and also do remember to pre-order it right now because you will be getting the 1 12 scale of the beautiful light up up reactor of iron man Mark 6, which I think is the very very first one shot scale up reactor that actually lights up in the market right now. So I hope you enjoyed this review and do give me a thumbs up if you like it and of course always feel free to leave me any comments below. And before you leave, of course I hope you will check out my playlist on the top right corner and also do feel free to browse around my channel for more interesting reviews such as this one and I'll see you in those videos. Bye!